Director of Surgery, Cancer and Diagnostics from the Whittington Hospital, London, UK. Professor Mohandas, distinguished guests, friends, ladies and gentlemen. This is going to be extremely short without any humor. For those of you who came expecting something else, please do not be disappointed. <laughs> the um, event that we have today is a truly important event. And we have with us someone who is... What made us think of starting with this year? There are lots of centers in India which offer ad hoc hematology surgery for the Now that can come from the patient himself, and the patient is in terms of remission, which we call autologous wound marrow transplantation, or we take it from a donor. And there can be different, that is an allogenic transplant, and there can be different types of allogenic transplant. Explaining the process of autologous transplant, you take the cells from the patient when the patient is in remission, you uh, process the cells, you freeze it, in the meantime you give radiotherapy or chemotherapy to the patient and then you Good afternoon, ladies and gentlemen. My name is Nick Harper. I am a consultant anesthetist and intensive care specialist by background. And that takes up half in death, in infancy or childhood without treatment. Treatment is complex and expensive and depends on usually on monthly blood transfusions and the problem with giving blood is that the patient then deposits iron into various organs and Minister, Mr. Howard Lyons, Professor Bohendas, Dr. Krippi, Dr. Harper, my diplomatic colleagues, Ajit Singh and Stefan, my German and Singaporean colleagues, I noticed that are from the limit of my technological skill. Just one of the
thing. I'm here to witness this and to approve of the drafting. <laughs> My good friend, the Councillor Representative from Singapore, Mr. Rajiv Singh, my close friends, senior colleagues from the government, uh, doctors, the staff of Mayon Hospitals, ladies and gentlemen. Uh, I'm here to uh, this hematology unit in Neon has come up with a groundbreaking uh, type of bone marrow transplant. So, uh, so we're celebrating, in effect, tuning and having the perfect environment so that it is not reject the transplant. It then engrafts like it was depicted in that video, and then after that we go back to the normal. Is that what it is? I think the registry in this country is pathetic. It virtually does not exist. This country needs to be educated about stem cells. The only area where stem cells that a pregnant woman is a carrier, then you would want to take a partner. Because if the partner is also a carrier, there is a one in four chance that the child might would have 